Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to another video of Travel Tech. And as you're seeing on the screen right now, I have put on the visualizer for the Digipad. I had made a detailed video regarding this visualizer for the Digipad about a year ago, I guess. And right now in this video, I am going to bring you the pro version or the unlocked version of the visualizer that will enhance your experience of the Digipad of the visualizer app as well. And as you're seeing on the screen right now, there are some bubbles flying around. Now, previously I had shown the stardust or the snowfall kind of a visualization happening in the Digipad. Now in this pro version or the unlocked version, there are several other changes which you can do to the visualizer app in order to enhance the experience. And whenever you play a song on your Digipad, the visualizer is going to give you a very beautiful display of music right on the screen. So guys, in this video, I'm going to show you in detail how you can get this visualizer for the Digipad in your Honda car. And it's a very simple and a easy method to get this visualizer. If you haven't watched my previous video and if you're new to the channel, which most likely you are, I would be guessing you would not have noticed the video wherein I had put up a detailed video regarding the downloading procedure of this visualizer app. So need not worry, you can watch this video and get to know in detail regarding the entire process and get this beautiful visualization app on your Digipad. So as you can see, as soon as the song stops, the visualization also stops. And as soon as the song begins again, the visualization starts again. So that is a very nice transition that happens on the Digipad screen. And because of this beautiful app, the driving experience has become much more visually elegant and much more interesting. So let's just go ahead and let's not make any delay in showing you the exact procedure to download the pro version or the unlocked version of this visualization app. So let me just first begin with saying that your Digipad must be connected to the internet in order to download any sort of an app which I have shown in my channel. So in case if you want to download any sort of an app on your Digipad, make sure you have connected the Digipad to the internet. And right now as you're seeing on the screen, there is a Wi-Fi logo right here. So I have connected my Digipad to my home network and as you can see the logo is right up there. If you don't know how to connect to the internet, you have to buy a TP-Link dongle or the Honda dongle, whichever it is convenient to you. Honda does provide a dongle along with the car if you have purchased it. And in case you have not purchased the dongle from the showroom, you can buy the dongle online at a very low price and I have given the link to purchase that dongle in the description below so once you have brought the dongle what you need to do is insert the dongle into the USB port right here below the digipad and once you have inserted the dongle your Wi-Fi networks are going to be shown up in the digipad and once the Wi-Fi network show up you can easily connect by entering the password of the particular Wi-Fi network the next thing which you need to do is go ahead and install the ES file manager yes the ES file manager is a very important amp and as you can see here right now this is the ES file explorer or the ES file manager now I have made a detailed video regarding how you can install the ES file manager also in the digipad so in case you haven't done that yet I'm going to give you a link in the description of this video so just click down on the description and you'll find the detailed video regarding how you can download and install this ES file manager so once you have downloaded and installed the ES file manager the next thing which you have to do is download and install the Firefox browser on the Digipad. So as you're seeing on the screen right now, here is the Firefox browser. So this is a very important browser because any of the apps and all of the apps which you are ever going to install on the Digipad are going to be downloaded using the Firefox browser. So in case you haven't downloaded and installed the Firefox browser as well, the link is in the description. You can go ahead and watch it and you can download and install the Firefox browser on the Digipad. So once these three things are done, that is the Internet is connected to the Digipad, ES File Explorer is installed and the Firefox browser is installed. The next step becomes very pretty easy in order to download and install the visualization or the visualizer pro for the Digipad. So the first thing which you need to do in order to download this particular app that is the visualizer pro app for the digipad is go ahead and click on the app section so once you have clicked on the app section go ahead and click on the firefox browser so once you have clicked on the firefox browser it's going to take a bit of a time and the firefox browser is going to open up on the digipad so as you're seeing on the screen right now the firefox browser has opened up so once it opens up just click on the url search bar and type in the address which i'm going to show you right now that is bit dot l y slash v i s p r o t r a v e l t e c h so guys this is the url address that is the b i t dot l y vis pro travel tech vis pro stands for visualizer pro 
So bit.ly v-i-s-p-r-o t-r-a-v-e-l t-e-c-h. So this is the URL address and in case it's difficult for you, I'm going to give this particular link in the description of this video as well. So by clicking on the description of this video, you will find this particular link. You can click on that link and download the app on your smartphone itself. So once the app gets downloaded on your smartphone, you can transfer it using a pen drive or an SD card onto the digipad and install it using the ES file manager. So you have that alternate method as well, but this is a direct method and it's the most faster method. So once you have typed in this particular URL address, just go ahead and click on the go button and wait for the web page to load. So guys, once the web page opens up, you are going to be greeted with this download button in the center of the screen and there will be a title saying the Visualizer Pro by Traveltech. So this is going to be the title and there is going to be a download button in the middle of the screen. So just go ahead and click on the download button and wait for the download to begin. So before the download begins, there is going to be a warning by the Google Drive saying Google Drive cannot scan this file for viruses. Just go ahead and click on the download anyway button in the middle of the screen. That is the blue button and wait for the download to begin. So there is going to be a dialog box asking you to select the downloader and it's going to ask if you can, if you want to do it always or just once. So just go ahead and click on the just once button and drag down the notification bar from the top of the screen of the digipad so as you can see the download complete dialog box has came up and here you go it's written here as download has completed so just go ahead and click on the download complete button and it is going to open up a window which is going to ask me to replace the application because i have already installed it so i'm just going to go ahead and click on the ok button so in your case in your digipad it is going to open up a installation window like this so just go ahead and click on the install button right here and wait for the app to get installed on the digipad so there you go guys the app has installed and there is a button called as open and done here so let's just go ahead and click on the open button so as soon as you op click on the open button, it is going to access the settings portion of the visualizer app. And there are going to be some options right here in the settings portion. And this is where all the action happens because the pro version or the unlocked version, it is going to give you option to have a custom theme. So this is the option which was not present in the previous version that is the free version. And in this custom theme, you are going to be able to customize the app into various features, into various colors. So here is some of the options that is the first option is set as live wallpaper. The second option is to view the wallpaper before setting. And uh, here is the option of the visualizer theme. So if I just go ahead and click on the visualizer theme. So here you go guys, here it is going to give you some of the shapes of the visualizer app. And here is a rotating ring and a sound wall 3D. So there are certain options right here. You can go ahead and select each one of them and try them out based on your preference. And also there is an option to increase or decrease the bar numbers. That is the number of bars that are vibrating on the screen. And here is the color theme. So this is where all the action happens. Just go ahead and click on the custom theme. So if you just go ahead and click on the custom theme, it is going to give you the option to change the bar color and also change the background color. So if I just go ahead and change the custom color of the bar, let me just go ahead and select the red color if possible. So here you go. I just drag down and selected the red color and uh, custom color background. I um, think I'm going to go ahead and select this metal honeycomb. Now it's not possible for me to show all the background colors and all the custom colors. So that, that is a thing which I'm going to leave for you guys to check out. So right now I have selected the red color and a metal honeycomb color. So let's just go back and see how this combination looks. So let's just go ahead and click on the view button right here. So guys, as you can see, the honeycomb pattern has appeared on the background and the bar color has changed to a red one. So this is how the visualization appears and this is how the customization can happen and it's going to give the digipad a much needed change, a much fresh change for the digipad and this is going to look amazing at night. Whenever you're going on a drive at night, when you're going on a, a long journey, this is going to soothe your mind and soothe your eyes whenever you take a look at it. So let's just go back and show you some of the other customizations that are available in the options so one more thing which i need to show you is the particle theme so here is an option called as particle theme so if i just go ahead and click on that there are three options they called as snowfall outer space and bubbles so the bubbles one i think you guys already saw that in the beginning of the video and the snowfall is the one which i have selected right now and there is one more called as outer space which is going to give you a starry appearance on the screen just like how the car as if it's traveling through the stars so you can select among these three of the particle theme. So these are some of the customization options that are available in the pro version. And uh, if I just go ahead and click on the set wallpaper button right below. So let's just go ahead and click on the set wallpaper. 
So guys, as I just saw, the wallpaper got set and this is how the wallpaper appears on the Digipad screen. It looks really wonderful and amazing to have this wallpaper, especially while driving at night. This is going to look amazing. And let me just go ahead and change the music a bit so that you guys can get a better idea of how this works. So guys, as you can see, I have put up a very peppy music and the visualization is happening very beautifully. And imagine while driving at night and this visualization is happening on the screen. This is going to bring a new charm to the car and a new look to the car and it's going to give you that really energetic feeling. So this is the visualization app for the Digipad guys, the pro app, the unlocked app. And this is specially brought to you by Travel Tech only and only for you guys. So in case you like this video guys, make sure you subscribe to my channel and make sure you like this video as well. And also write down in the comment below how you found out this video to be, how you found out this app to be. The detailed method of downloading this app I just showed you, you have to write in the link into the Firefox browser or you can also click down on the description of this video and you can click on the description and download it on your smartphone itself and transfer it to the Digipad using a pen drive or an SD card and you can install it using the ES file manager. So the three things which you need to follow is make sure your Digipad is connected to the internet. The second thing is make sure you have installed the ES file manager and of course the third thing is make sure you have installed the Firefox browser. So this is a very beautiful app and a very amazing app for the Digipad and this is going to enhance the look and feel of the Digipad on your screen. So as you're seeing on the screen right now the visualization appears extremely wonderful. This is going to look very well and your Digipad is going to look unique and because no other car has this no other car will ever have this only the Digipad units the Digipad 1 units of Honda cars are going to have this and this is brought to you only by Travel Tech. So guys, this is a special video for today and I hope you like the effort that has been put in making this video. So reminding you once more, make sure you have subscribed to my channel and of course make sure you have liked this video. Thank you for watching and until next video, until the next app for the Digipad, have a really nice day.